morning to you ladies, my name is Jacksepticeye and welcome back to Subnauseous. The gun is down, the world is cured, everybody's happy. I have no idea what I'm doing in this episode because everything else was like a straightforward plan. Knew where I was going, knew what I was doing, knew what the progress was, knew the location which I was going in. Now I'm kind of all over the place because everything is kind of messed up. I know I'm making the rocket. I know that's like my next port of call. Wait, you fuckers are still around? Okay, I kind of want to test this. Are you going to come after me? They don't bother me anymore! Because I'm cured! Oh, awesome! Okay. I I don't know who to take. Wait, Sally's all the way out there. Okay. I wanted to take Sally back. I'm sorry, Pepper. I'm so sorry. I will try and get. Wait, let's just try to test this again. Hello? Hi, it's me. Number one cured boy. That's awesome! And it makes perfect sense, I'm glad that that actually happens. Because that was one of the things where I was like, are they not going to bother me now because I'm cured? And I guess not. Hey, look at the gun. Wow! That's awesome! So literally everything from here on out now is brand new territory. Like, I've, I've never done any of this stuff sake, you keep disappearing when I want to scan you. Any, anything after the last episode now, even like most of the last episode, it's all brand new. It's all stuff that I've never done before in this game, so... Now that I'm kind of... Yeah, fuck you. Uh, now that I'm kind of all over the place... Um... It, it might be a bit slower to get some progress in the series now. Just because I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know where I get the blueprints for the next parts of the the rocket. Wait, why are you reacting? Why are you making sounds? Stop that! I need to go in and get the stuff out of the back of Pepper. Even though right now, the sea moth is absolutely... I don't have that much room. Now I have more room. So I think you had some good shit in the back of you. I will be back to get you. I just, in case I need some of this stuff at the fabricator now. Actually, I don't need you. I'm not wasting time picking up you because I can just get you back at the safe shallows anyway. Okie dokie. Moving on. Hey, Reefies. Where are you? Where are you, you big babies? You big bouncy babies. I love the Reefies. There you are, my big, beautiful, bouncy baby boy! You're the best, man. Best character in the game. By far. Um, okay, I need to go to this little vehicle thing. Because I need to figure out what actually goes into this first piece. It's gonna be a lot of farming. Which I don't really like. Neptune escape rocket. Four lead and two titanium ingots. That's not too bad. All that shit is down here! Stupid. I built this base and I was like, okay, I'm gonna have to build a new base because we're not gonna come back here for a while. I've been back here more times than I have been in that, that actual base. It sucks! Because all my materials now are back there. Oh, and there's no easy way to get back to it either. What are you? You're the fucking microscope thing that I didn't end up needing. So... Titanium ingots. They're easy get. I can get them from here. Lead I can get from here as well. It's just... A bit more annoying to get lead. Because it's in specific areas. Where I had a bunch of lead... Back there! I got something to show ya. I've got something in here. 
I have got the parts for a Neptune launch rocket base. Do we need to move Sally out of there? Sally, I'm gonna move you out of there, okay? You guys hold tight for a sec. Sorry, Sally. Move your keister, meester. Actually, you can just go in here and charge. I don't know why I didn't do that. That's what the moon pool's for. Thanks. Appreciate it. I'm going back out here to do a thing now. Okay, okay, okay. I'm excited to see what this looks like. I've never seen it. I've never seen any of the parts for the, the, the rocket. Go! Oh my god, it's gigantic! That's just a launch platform? Holy fuck! Whoa! It's like a building! Okay, you are taking forever to build this thing. There you go. Oh, mama. Look at the fucking size of this. So the rocket goes in there? Jesus Christ. Oh, maybe from here now I can start building the other parts. Plasteel ingot, copper wire, lubricant. This stuff is not that hard to make. Can I- can you- can you just make it right now? Go! Go! Make it! Go! No. I might have to take a trip back down into the deep dark down deep dark. Just to get my stuff. But I really don't want to. <laughs> it's so far away and it takes so much time, but I'm trying to think if it would just take as much time to search for these items. Plus tea lingot. I just need a lot of titanium and... Wait, is it in here now what I actually need? Yeah. And that's just the Neptune gallery. So, uh, this is probably gonna be broken up into multiple episodes trying to build this rocket because I'll just be here for like three hours trying to get all the materials to build the rocket itself. And I think it comes in like three, four, five parts. Lubricant, easy to get. Copper wire, easy to get. Plasteel ingots. Actually, that's not that hard to get. I don't need to go all the way back down. I just need to go back to the island to get some lithium. Oh, that's cool! I actually have a rocket symbol now! It's not just Henry or Seamoth or anything. I didn't think about that. Of course I have a, a rocket symbol. I'd need to know where I'm going because you could literally build it anywhere on the planet. But I want to build it beside Henry. We started off at Henry, we're going to finish at Henry. We want to stay there, and that's how we're going to leave the planet. Do I have enough room to pick up one of these? No, I do not, actually. Okay, I'm going to get rid of some of my waters, because I do have a fine supply. And now I'm back in the safe shallows, and I don't really have to go anywhere else. I don't have to do any long, arduous journeys anymore. All of those, like, super long journeys are now a thing of the past, unless some final part of this fucking thing needs kyanite or something like that. Because that would suck. Because <laughs> that would mean I'd have to go all the way back down into deep dark down deep dark. And we all know how much I love that area. Oh my god, look at the size of this thing. I mean, I know I said it already, and I know it's big, but Jesus Christ! You forget! <laughs> I also need to grab a lot more metal to make some more titanium. Because I don't have that right now. I just have bits and pieces of other stuff. Um, you're charged enough, you don't need to go in the moon pool. Bum, ba -da -bum, ba -da -ba 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 -bum. So, a lesson for you if you're following along my series and you want to do stuff your own way. Um, don't... You forget about me. Don't remove all your supplies and put it in another base down in the fucking lava zone. That was stupid. And now it's dicking me over because all of my really good materials are down there and I have literally no use for that location anymore. Kinda sucks, but you know what? You live, you learn, you be stupid, you do other things, you grow up. I'm gonna make a battery. If anything, just to clear up some space. Make a wiring kit. 
I will keep my silver ore for now, just in case I need it later. Uh, and then put you some of you guys in here. I have some lead, uh, the plasteel, and the thing in there, and then these. So I don't need you right now. I do need the lithium though in a second. One of these is zero charge, and one of these is full charge, so I'm gonna keep the full charge one out. You can go in there. And laser cutter, you can go in there. I don't need you anymore. I don't need you anymore. Cool. Now we have a lot of space. I can just grab all the metal I want. Because I'm gonna try and grab more metal than I probably need. I mean, I could start dismantling some of this shit. Oh wait, I do need to go in and get some food anyway. Because a lot of this stuff has titanium in it and... Don't exactly need it anymore. Ah, perfect. Fully loaded, ready to be exploded. Alright, Sal. Let's go hunt some metal. There's a lot back in this direction, because this is where the stalkers hang out by the, the creep vines. Wait! Why have I never put together that the stalkers hang around the creeps? <laughs> That's amazing! <laughs> the stalkers hang around the creep vines! Stalkers and creeps together! I love that! Okay, okay, okay. You know what? You're just about to- you're about to get the business right now. If you don't leave me alone, there you go. There you go. You're getting the business. I didn't fucking hit you and I'm damaging myself like an idiot. Yeah, showed him! Oh, Jesus, sorry! Oh, no! Oh, I drove over a bunch of them. We got some copper, so now we can make some copper wire. That should be all the parts we need then, to make the next part, the gallery. Is that like the elevator that's gonna lead up to it? And park. Beautiful. Perfect job. Best parking spot. Also realized there was a creepvine seed cluster right outside my area. Didn't see that. Forgot that that was there. That would have come in handy a little while ago. Um... Is that it? Can I build it? Yeah, baby! Okay. Next step in the process. It's coming together! I like this. I like how consistent the designs are as well, by the way. Like how it has like this like meshy carbon fiber, this color and the yellow stripes and everything. Like the Aurora has the same thing, my base and all that kind of stuff has the same look to it. It's very clean, it's a very sterile look, but it's consistent with all the other stuff, which I really like. Construct that bad boy! My god, you take forever. But that's okay. So this is, I go up that little elevator, or ladder, or whatever's there, and this is gonna hold on to the side of the ship. Side of the rocket, and then I walk into it. I'm now playing Subnautica Space Program. Kerbal Subnautica. Okay, what's next on the list? Please be something easy to make. Please be something easy to make. Please be something easy to make. Oh, fuck. The Neptune Boosters are next. Oh, this is so cool. Can I go open it now? Just to see what it's like? No. Wait, maybe I can. Call elevator. I'm clicking it, but nothing happening. Man, oh wait. <gasps> It was there! I thought this was a piece of ground! Yeah! Hi, Henry! Look at me go! And then you would walk into the rocket right here. Oh, Jesus Christ, this is high up. You can even see the islands from here! God, that's cool! Oh, I can't wait to have all the pieces together! Wow! The animations of it are so awesome! Okay! Well, I'm gonna have to leave this episode here. I know it's a shorter episode. I know I didn't do a whole lot. I got these built, though. Which is pretty fucking insane. 
Um, but I don't have a lot of time to record today. I, I have other stuff going on. I'm so sorry. But I will be back tomorrow with hopefully the whole rocket built. I don't know if we'll get to the end. I'm kind of reluctant to get to the end as well because I don't want this to end. Um, and if it does if it does end soon, I'm still gonna be doing stuff in the game. I'm still gonna be looking around and trying to get stuff and all that kind of thing. There's still a lot of blueprints I don't have, there's a lot of lore I probably don't have, that kind of stuff, so... It's not gonna end immediately, but... The story might come to an end in the next episode. Or depending on how many more parts I need to build. So I need to build the boosters and then I'm gonna need to build the, like... The cab, the actual, like, shuttle part of it, so... I don't know, but for now... Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, punch the like button in the face, like a buzz, and I pay the rent. Whoosh, whoosh. Thank you guys, and I will see all you dudes. I gotta go into the deep down, dark deep down!